All right, so I just got back from the gym. I did some triceps today and then a little cardio. Um, took Duke out this morning, time to eat breakfast. It's about, it's like 1.15 right now. I'm gonna whip up some breakfast. Uh, I've had a couple people mention the fact that I'm uh, shirtless in a lot of my videos and they're like, why, are you, why, why shirtless though? And for me, the answer is really simple and really easy. It's just the fact that when I'm home, I'm naturally usually just shirtless and I just usually wear shorts or sometimes I'm just in my underwear. And um, so it's not really a conscious choice for me. It's just the way that I am and I'm vlogging daily vlogs like just the way that I am. So it's just, it happens to be how I am most of the time. It's not like I'm deciding, oh, I wanna be shirtless in all my videos so I can be like sexy. <laughs> That wasn't my thought process. Um, it's just like, if I'm shirtless, I'm shirtless. If I'm not, I'm not. That's just the way it is. And yeah, I don't really give it a second thought. So anyway, that's my little tangent about that. I, okay, it's 1.15. I got, I'm gonna do eggs. I gotta make some potatoes come because I'm all out of my meal prep. So I'll have enough for the week. Yesterday, my coach said, when I went to go uh, do posing with him, he said, no more, no more Diet Coke which is my guilty pleasure, and no more energy drinks, uh, no more anything with artificial sweeteners in it. And I asked him why, he said, because artificial sweeteners can give you inflammation. If you, for example, like he said, if you're used to drinking Diet Coke all the time, then it's probably not an issue, your body's probably used to it, which is the case with me. I drink Coke, Cherry Coke Zero all the time. It's like, it's my guilty pleasure for sure. And so it's probably not an issue with me, but in the coaching process and with creating the diet and all of that, it's just the best practice to take out any variables that might have negative effects. Even if they don't necessarily, just the potential for it, it's best just to do away with it so that you create the best scenario and you have the best opportunity to do well and for your body to respond well. So that's gonna be difficult though for me because I love having my Coke Zero with lunch and dinner. So instead I have water, iced tea unsweetened, and black coffee at this point. Those are my staples. I've been drinking a lot of coffee lately, especially first thing in the morning. And I do have some news. You guys saw the video where I was talking with Tara from Purity Coffee and we're doing a little partnership. I love, I love their coffee. It's delicious. It's become part of my daily routine now and I'll be um, doing a special little video on that um, and have a little promotion for you guys soon. I'm just waiting on word from Tara, so we'll see. Anyway, breakfast time. Oh yeah, um, and then it's actually, you know what? Arr, scratch that, I'm gonna do some posing because I gotta do that actually first. I wanna do that first thing after my workouts. <sighs> okay, let's see what I remembered from yesterday. I come out waving. Okay, we get to the second one, and then I'm gonna come down stage. Oh wait, yeah, so the second one. And then, and then I think I just go to the next position. And then here I'm gonna do this, there. Or I don't know if I do side pose first. Walk this side. Da, da.
16. Whew. That's tiring. I gotta build up my endurance for that. It's crazy because that last week is so intense and I'm so drained. Everyone is. And then you're carb loading the night before and the morning of. And you get on stage and you're like still depleted. And you gotta get up there and hold these like intense poses for for quite a while. And then like for example, when I'm done, I go to the side and the next competitor comes out and he does his routine. And like I can't just stand there like this. I gotta be the entire time like smiling, posing, changing in the background while they're doing that. So it's exhausting. <laughs> and then once everybody's come out and done their poses and I'm standing there still going, then they're like, okay, everybody side by side, we go side by side, and then we do our mandatory poses next to each other so they can compare us all side by side by side. So it's like, you're going for a while, 10 minutes or so, nonstop of just like flexing as hard as you can and trying not to breathe through your stomach, trying to do like these shallow breaths through your chest. <laughs> Anyway, these are the mandatory poses that you do side by side with other competitors. That's, so that's like, that's like the minimum of what they'll have us do side by side. And like, if they wanna see like, say I'm the first competitor, there's a second guy, and then a third guy, and they wanna see me next to the third guy, they'll be like, competitor one, switch with competitor two. And then we'll switch, and now two and three are next to each other, and then they'll have us do more posing so that they can see what we look like. And it's exhausting. Okay, it's good for now, I'm gonna eat breakfast. <laughs> 